hello family welcome to another wonderful section at i do know it at i do know it right here with you is mr favor francis and today i'm gonna be taking you on a journey to get to know how to get this wonderful this incredible software called power bi power bi so if you're having issues on how to get the software you want to download the software i'm going to be showing you how to do that especially those of you that are on a windows pc i'm going to be showing you how to get the software on windows now first of all what is power bi power bi is an abbreviation for power business intelligence power business intelligence now the power bi is a business analytical tool by this wonderful company microsoft this wonderful company microsoft um the same company that are the founders of the office packages like excel uh, microsoft word uh, powerpoint right and so on and so forth so power bi is a business analytical tool by microsoft that helps you turn raw data into interactive insight and visual and visual reports and visual reports so if you're looking for that software that analytical software that gives you the ability to create incredible visual reports then you want to give it up for power bi you want to give it up to power bi so i'm going to be showing you how to quickly get this power bi installed on your pc especially for those of you that are on a windows pc right so the first thing you're going to go to you're going to do the step a is to find your microsoft store so this tool is provided by microsoft so in order for you to get it downloaded you're going to get it downloaded from the microsoft store on your pc so you can go to your menu and then you go to your search bar and just type the microsoft store you can go to microsoft store and then you're going to see the microsoft store app are you seeing it so you can go there search for the microsoft store app and you're going to see this app right here right if you have the app already pinned on your tax bar you can go ahead and click the app from your tax bar or else just go ahead search for it from your search and then you get this app the microsoft store app so i'm going to click on this store app the moment i click on the store app the store app is going to open for me for those of you that have outdated windows operating system this might give you some challenges so it is right here you're going to find out if you have outdated um, um windows operating system so if you have some outdated windows operating system then you might have some um, challenges you might have some issue uh getting into the microsoft uh, store platform is that okay so you want to make sure you update your you want to make sure you update your windows operating system to the most recent version as possible for those of you um uh, making use of for those of you making use of um the windows 10 you want to make sure you update maybe to an earlier version of the windows 10 operating system or you can update to um the most recent version which is uh the windows um 11 which is the windows 11 operating system so you want to do yourself a favor and make that switch and make that change is that okay so do yourself that favor you want to make that switch you want to make that change as fast as you can is that okay so we are going to head into our uh, microsoft store which we are in already so you can see it is opening having a little um internet um delay so now once you're in your microsoft store you go to your search bar and then you're going to type power bi so you type power bi on your search bar so just type power bi power bi okay now the moment you type power bi right now there are different apps that might that might be uh shown to you so i'm just going to click the power bi search result in order to get the search the different search results for power bi so i'm just going to click the search result to get the different search result for power 
BI. Okay, now the different search results are up. So you can see the first one, the Power BI Desktop. You see the second one, the Power BI Report Builder. You see the second, the, the third one rather, the Power Apps. And you might see other things related to Power right here. But the one we are installing or the one you need is the Power BI desktop what did i say the power bi desktop so if you have not installed it before like me mine is already installed it's showing here installed already so i just need to update my because of uh, maybe it's been a while i updated so i'll just need to update my but if you haven't installed yours just click on the power bi just click on the app click on the app remember the power bi desktop that is what you're installing and then once you click on the app if you have not installed yours you're going to see a button here that says installed you can see my is showing open because of i've installed my already but if you have not installed yours you're going to see a button here that says install so you want to go ahead and start installing so the moment you click on install it will start downloading on your pc for you you give it some time right depending on your network speed your internet connectivity speed i recommend you using a very good um internet um connectivity um a very good internet connectivity to install this so that it's not going to delay you it's going to be fast and again you want to make sure that um any pc you're installing this on the pc has a very good ram size right and the pc has a very good and fast operating system so the moment you are done installing you are going to see this button that says open you can go ahead and open your power bi is that okay for those of you that are joining us on our live section we're going to be using this power bi to show you how to create amazing visualization amazing data visualization amazing data analytics as a professional data and i'm as a professional data analyst using power bi thank you so much my name is Romance favor francis i'm always remember that at id innovate learning is a foundation to innovation see you in the next lesson